Welcome. I'm Keith, a critical care nurse and nurse educator who is passionate to see you succeed. Today, I'm going to share a simple strategy that helped my students nail pharmacology. It would also do the same for you. If you could know only one thing about a medication, what is the most important thing to know? When there is so much content to learn in nursing school, TMI makes it difficult to know what is most important. But when it comes to pharmacology, there are over 5,000 medications and nursing drug handbooks are over 1,000 pages in length. You simply can't know it all and you don't have to. Every drug manual has the following categories of content that must be known at some level. What is the pharmacologic class, indications, mechanism of action, pharmacokinetics, contraindications, side effects, interactions, route and dosage, nursing implications, and patient teaching? But what is the most important? From my lens of clinical practice, the mechanism of action. But it must not just be written down on a med sheet and parroted verbatim to the instructor. It must be put in your own words and then deeply understood. Let me explain. Furosemide, a loop diuretic, has the following description in the mechanism of action of a drug handbook. It inhibits the reabsorption of sodium and chloride from the loop of Henle and distal renal tubule. It increases renal excretion of water, sodium, chloride, magnesium, potassium, and calcium. Knowing that filtrate in the distal tubule is high in sodium, water will follow. This results in significant diuresis. But when A and P is deeply understood, this relationship and physiologic impact to the body will identify common complications and expected side effects. When the mechanism of action is understood, and not simply parroted. The following side effects will now become obvious because of volume depletion, dehydration, hypotension, the need to assess the fluid status, including daily weights, as well as urine output, the electrolyte abnormalities of hypokalemia, hyponatremia as well. Now, if you're a student, make it a priority to deeply understand A and P and transfer this knowledge to the mechanism of action of the most common medications that you give. If you struggle with this content, know that you are not alone. And that is why I wrote a book for students titled Think Like a Nurse. This content simplifies pharmacology and is now available on Amazon with free shipping. If you found this video helpful, share this link or subscribe to my channel, Think Like a Nurse. Or better yet, Leave a comment below with the most important thing you learned and will apply to your practice. Thanks so much.